Hi everyone, welcome to my channel Crew Bites. Today let's try a very simple continental meal. Continental food refers to the delicacies consumed mainly in the European countries and the key speciality of this food is the minimal usage of spices. Today's recipe includes grilled chicken with mushroom sauce along with mashed potatoes and sauteed veggies. So let's get started. At first, let's grill the chicken. Here I'm using two small chicken breasts. Also you need garlic powder, black pepper powder, salt, mixed dried herbs and flour. So at first we're going to season the chicken breast. I'm adding some salt. One or two teaspoons of uh, crushed black pepper or black pepper powder. One teaspoon of garlic powder. Alternatively you can use crushed garlic. Half a teaspoon of mixed dried herbs. One teaspoon of flour, which is my the all-purpose flour, and about a tablespoon of olive oil. Now rub these uh, ingredients all over the chicken breast so that the chicken breasts are seasoned well with these ingredients. And now we're going to set this aside for at least 20 minutes. After 20 minutes, heat a pan and add a few tablespoons of butter and one or two tablespoons of olive oil as well. We're going to grill the chicken in the pan. Alternatively, you can grill the chicken in the oven. Uh, for more instructions, please refer the description box. So now add the chicken breast to the pan. Keep a low to medium flame and just um, uh, cook the chicken breast until they are well done by flipping uh, both sides. You can keep it covered for first three minutes so that it gets cooked easily. See one side is all almost uh, turned golden brown. Chicken breast gets cooked easily so it might take another you know three to five minutes. Do remember to flip it every now and then so that it doesn't get stuck to the bottom of the pan as well. If you're using non-stick pan, it will be much easier. So the chicken breasts are well done now. I'm transferring that to a plate. Switch off the flame. Now let's move on to the mushroom sauce for the chicken. For this you need one and a half cups of sliced mushrooms, crushed black pepper, butter, fresh cream, garlic, flour and salt to taste. Here I am using the same pan in which we had grilled the chicken so that the flavor of the chicken gets added to the mushroom sauce. So add 1 tablespoon of butter and 1 and a half cup of sliced mushrooms. Keep a medium flame and saute the mushrooms well. And now I am going to add garlic. Here I am grating one clove of garlic. You can use half teaspoon of garlic powder instead. Mix well. To this I am adding one tablespoon of flour. Mix well. Flour is being added to thicken the sauce. Alternatively you can use cornstarch as well if you are allergic to flour. Now I've added two teaspoons of crushed black pepper, mix well, and a cup of water. If you have vegetable stock or chicken stock, please use that instead. Mix really well, adding salt to taste. Now keep the flame to low and add one cup of fresh cream. well and cook for another one or two minutes see the sauce is already uh, 
started to thicken adding a pinch of dry herbs that's optional but it gives a very good flavor to the sauce switch off the flame and transfer this to a bowl I'm adding two teaspoons of grated cheese this is completely optional and mix well and set aside now let's see how to prepare the mashed potatoes here I have used two medium sized potatoes which have been boiled and peeled also you need black pepper garlic fresh cream butter and salt at first heat a pan and add a tablespoon of butter to it once the butter is melted grate one clove of garlic or you can use half a teaspoon of garlic powder or if you do not like the taste of garlic you can completely omit garlic keep a low flame and just saute the garlic in the butter now we are adding the potatoes which have been cooked earlier and mashed well to the pan mix well adding salt to taste here I have used unsalted butter but if you are using salted butter please uh, add salt accordingly now I am adding one cup of fresh cream you can add one cup of milk instead but adding cream gives the mashed potatoes a more rich and creamy taste mix really well keep a low flame and I'm adding another half a cup of fresh cream as well so in total I have added one and a half cups of fresh cream mix well so that you uh, you get a very smooth mixture keep a low flame it might take another one or two minutes uh, to cook the uh, mashed potatoes because the potatoes have already been cooked it just need to be uh, mixed well with the cream and the seasoning switch off the flame and now I'm adding a teaspoon of crushed black pepper and also one tablespoon of grated cheese mix well and transfer to a bowl now let's move on to sauteed veggies here I'm using carrots and green beans you can use any other veggies of your choice also you need butter crushed black pepper and salt so at first heat a pan and add enough water to cook the veggies add some salt as well and keep it covered and allow the water to boil once the water boils we are adding the veggies here I have used two carrots and about 10 to 12 green beans keep it covered and cook for just three to four minutes drain it now add a tablespoon of butter to the pan and add in the boiled veggies to it keep a medium flame and saute the veggies in the butter adding some black pepper and a pinch of salt and saute for another one or two minutes this is a very simple and quick meal which can be prepared in no time see now the veggies are ready switch off the flame so that's it our continental meal is ready to serve so to a plate at first place the grilled chicken breast and pour the mushroom sauce over it and serve it along with mashed potatoes and sauteed vegetables i hope you all enjoyed today's video and see you all soon with more good recipes until then goodbye